Y'all, it's Tracy. My channel is Tracy from the Mermaid Cove. Welcome. <coughs> I am doing a decluttering under my kitchen sink. So my um dish that um my dishwasher stopped working. My friend Kenny's like a like a brother from another mother uh, is coming over. So I need to take everything out, right? So thought I'd bring you with me. <clears throat> uh, yeah, yeah. So anyway, first get my trash bag. So how are you guys, right? How would it look under your sink? I know some people hardly have anything. Yeah, but okay. So here is a cleaner, almost empty. I'll put that in the new one. Here is this awesome LA, almost empty. Now this is from Dollar, not Dollar, yeah, Dollar Tree. If you guys haven't tried it, you should try it. It's really good. But what I do is I put it in an old bottle. I think they have them now, but you know, the triggers aren't good. So that's what I do with that. So there's enough room, I can do that. I have some Lysol wipes. So I got me a bag here. Got my trusty Ikea bag. So what I need to put back. This is this Mr. Clean Clean Freak. This is the lemon. I'm, I'm really liking this. This is one of the first things that came back on the shelves. And it when you it, it's like a mist. Yeah, I really, really like it. And this is the fruit and vegetable wash from Trader Joe's. So you wash your stuff and I like it. It's like under $4. You only need a little bit. <clears throat> so I'm going to use this up because I'm going to be eating all kinds of fruits and veggies. Um, some hand soap. The real deal method, the grapefruit, right? Yeah, pink grapefruit my favorite. So that's a keep. This is multi number four purpose cleaner vinegar and lemon oil orange blossom. I'm not sure if my mom like got this at TJ Maxx or something. Cleaners don't go bad, right? What I might do is put this in my garage because I'm getting ready to do some stuff in the garage. So that's what I'm gonna do with that. Actually the LA cleaner is probably better. The end of I think this is what my, no, yep, these are good. So maybe I don't need these there. I can go put these somewhere else. Uh, the Cascade with the Oxy. I usually use, um, you know, these things, right? But I don't know, I, I guess it was on sale or something. and So I got it, keep that. This is what I'm living on right now. Bissell Professional Pet Stain and Odor Removal. Ugh, enough said. I could probably just go out in my living. So my cleaners are coming to, not my cleaners. Um, <coughs> carpet cleaners are coming. So I have almost everything picked up. I still have to do like their litter box area, get that cleaned up and a few pieces of furniture outside. But luckily it's super nice. You know, a brush. I've actually been through this lately, so. Cleaning gloves from Dollar Tree, large. Okay. So this is micro band 24 hour cleaner. This is new. I have the, the stuff that's like Lysol that's micro band that really, uh, they have it at airports and hospitals. So I spray that if I feel like I've been compromised. Okay, hot spot, hot, spot shot this used to be the thing we use for carpet cleaners but not anymore so this needs to go i'm not sure i gotta figure out how to recycle that the good old lysol my friend got me I'm not biggest fan of the smell of lysol more clorox so i can probably put those in here right so you guys just only keep exactly what you need in here um i actually i love cleaning out the uh do this right uh, i love cleaning out under here i do it all the time so 
So we cycle, right? You know, if you, that's two. If it's a six, you can't recycle it. It's called Nix Six. But, because they say it's worse to put things that can't be recycled, it really hurts it. This Dollar Tree, you get four for a dollar, Cascade Platinum, like my emergency ones. I don't know if that's a good or good deal or not. I haven't finished. Finish. So this is also um, for the dishwasher, right? And they're in, I think so. I think this is good for clean. I put it in to clean my thing. So today when he gets it working, I will put one of these in and run it. You know, I know about the filter. I cleaned the filter out now. Somebody told me about that. Okay, so we have Myers Clean Day Mum Scent and Myers Clean Day Multi Purpose Every Day Lemon. I don't think I like this mum stuff. I think it was a. Uh, I don't like flowery smells. Anyway, I'm gonna put these down where my house cleaner stuff is, and they can use that up. <clears throat> so that's a good bottle to have. So this is Lemon Bright. Uh, my friend used to sell this stuff. What is it? Um, Maluka or something? Hand dishwashing liquid. So I have to say this. It's lemon. It's a concentrate, I think, right? So you don't use a lot. Anyway, I will keep that. Kitchen cabinet cream. Now, if you guys, I went through it once after my mom died, but I need to do it again. If you got, I was, it was okay. I don't notice a huge change, but if you guys know one that's really good for cleaning the kitchen cupboard, let me know. Barkeeper's Friend Cleanser. I usually use this when I do magic marker somewhere or leave like raspberries and it stains. Works really good. The All Beloved Microvan Sanitizing Spray. Every time I see one, I get one. Not gonna hoard them. But you know, we're never gonna not need stuff like that. So Bissell Spot Lifter. I'm gonna put this downstairs because I don't use it very often because I like the other stuff. <clears throat> Stainless steel wipes. You know, I've used these before, but I think it leaves like a weird coating on it. I have to read through it really carefully. I didn't like it last time. My lighting is, the light's early in the morning. Well, yeah, it's almost nine. So my friend Kenny's coming at like 10.30. The, cleaner, the carpet cleaners are 11.30. Again, Lysol. So I'm gonna put one up. I have a little storage area of everything, so I know what I have. Again, large gloves, so they'll go there. I don't, I don't, I see I have too much under here that I don't need. All right, so this is plant water. Don't have any idea. It's my mother. Stain, odor, and eliminator for pet urine. I don't think that can go downstairs. I've tried everything. Professional Carpet Spot Remover, Folex. That will go downstairs. I hate to throw it out, but that Bissell is everything. Okay. Mir Nature Miracles Advance, Stain Odor Eliminator Foam. Yeah, the, the struggle's real, people. But the Bissell is my favorite now. Shot, spot Shot Professional Stain Remover. <laughs> So I have some easy off, I wanna do my, so this is heavy duty. This is fume free. I think I will use this one. Literally since the day after the pandemic and we were home, I've been trying to use that. So I'm not sure what to tell you, other than I don't feel like cleaning it. Okay. So I have this little thing. Magic erasers, and I need to use this on my walls. My mom, it used to drive her nuts. And this is BioClean. This she got, I know she got this at QVC. So I don't, ew, I don't know. I guess you have to wet it, right? I have to read up on this because my outside, my white post things, you know, around my deck, they're gross. So I thought, you know, I could get that and I could do 10 minutes a day. I'm going to spend a whole day because I won't. Glisten Dishwasher Magic. 
So one of these you put in and it cleans. But I'm gonna try that tablet. I keep all my manuals and stuff here for anything to do in the kitchen. I think these are cleaners for that, rags for that cleaner. So let me start my new bag. These are the cleaners. Oh my God, I am so sorry, y'all. Sorry about that. Anyway, these are these big bags. I get them at five below and they have zippers. They are the magic bags. That's all I'm gonna call them. You can put so much, I, what now I do for holidays and stuff, I have one, you know, I get the ones at Christmas. One of these, I'll keep that. Uh, so I have, I don't know, the little wrenchy thing you need for your dishwash, your garbage disposal. One of my sponges, I could take that out today. Got this sponge. I got, you know, these things if they need a really good cleaning. I think these three came from Dollar Tree. Another scrubbing, another scrubbing. That should go through the dishwasher. I think I got these at Dollar Tree. Sponge, probably Dollar Tree. So yeah, so these are all just um, the, uh, SLS pads. Whoops. So these are little sponges um, that come from Trader Joe's that pop up. So now you need to go in something. Now another piece of plastic. My micro cloth. Okay. It's like a halo, you can't see me. Anyway, so all that's gonna go here. another instructions and I'll go you know I'm gonna go through my instructions because I saw one for a cat feeder that I don't have anymore because it was letting out too much cat food the whole idea was he could eat something and not be so angry during the day when I was gone bottle scrubber these are little trash bags my friend gave me that don't work in my trash can but they work I mean the big one but they work in the little one so I should put this actually where my cleaners can see that there's a whole bag of them. And there we go. We have another bag. Bags everywhere. These are the things from Trader Joe's. But um, you'll see, I'll probably be up before this, a, um, let's see if this makes a difference. Uh, no, it was not good. Oh, sorry. It's a mess. Dollar Tree Hall, where you can get something really similar, a Dollar Tree, two for a dollar. Now... Excuse me, I got some little things here. So these again are these cleaners for the dishwasher. This is supposed to be a, you know, take a lint and cat hair. All right, so now, and then I, this is Dollar Tree, just, you know, if you need to wash something you don't want to put in the dishwasher kind of thing. I have one friend that loves to wash dishes by hand when she comes. Okay, now look at the tea towels. Yeah, I love a towel. My mom and I always got them all the time and I don't anymore. One, I'm not in anywhere shopping for that kind of stuff. People give them to me, she's nice. Humongous, you know what, this is perfect. I could put my clothes I'm giving to the doll, um, to the Goodwill, not the Goodwill, Think, help me, food bank. So these are just all my towels. <clears throat> so I'll go through those and, you know, maybe let some go. See, sometimes aren't bags precious? You know, recycle that. Again, tea towels. Or dishcloths, I guess, what do you call them? And then my old cut-up sweatshirts and um, T-shirts. Pair of gardening gloves. I don't know what one anyway. Another one of my little stands. More tea. Hey, Clara. More tea towels. More tea towels. I mean, some of them are super cute. Like, look at this one. This is blue cute. We always love these kind. They're cute. 
my friend from Arizona. It's an Arizona thing. Of course, mermaid hair, don't care. Actually, I would like to cut that and put that on the back of a shirt. <laughs> I, my friends laugh because I always say that and I don't do it. But hey, I'm going to do it from a channel. The cute little cat towel. The babies. So yeah. These are old napkins. Like from fast food places. More towels, more towels, more towels, more towels. So let me get rid of these. I think about how many do I really need in my life. Or at least put them. I don't know. Rotate them. Or I don't know. I gotta let some go I think. Now, see, I have some bags. Oh my God. Seriously, this is nuts. Okay, bag, bag, bag. Another, I have so many of these things now from the giant grocery thing. They put everything in those bag bags. I have a bag problem, seriously. And I would love to move past it. I don't know why. And boxes, oh, I'm better because you have to be. Bag. Yeah. And there's people who I know bag who would just think, what are you, how can you have a problem with bags? Well, you can. Bag. Sometimes I have a friend who likes stuff and it's harder for her than me to get rid of stuff. So I know she's not going to throw them out, so I give them to her. Just isn't that sad? That's sad. It's mean. Okay. So now we have baking stuff. So my cookie sheets, like a brownie pan. There's another towel. There's another. Anyway. So this is where I just keep all my cookie sheets. Right? Because none of my other, I don't know what that's for. None of my other, my broiler pan, broiler pan, cookie sheet, cookie sheet. Oh, sorry. Cookie sheet. I'm going to pause. That's annoying. Okay, guys, that's a noisy. So, more bag. I found some garbage bags back there. So, that's good. I just bought a new one, but use those up. Okay. So. Now I can clean it, right? Just give it a nice scrub. And then maybe I'll have to have a chat with you guys as I try to let go of bags and, um, well, yeah, it's ridiculous with Mimi being gone and you know none of her stuff going with her. I'm in that mood right now where just, you know, make my life simple, right? I'd like to open this up, have towels, not have them fallen and shoved. So, or get my cookie plates out without there being a scene. That, I remember, that is a goal to make my life easier, right? And having all these rags is not, you know, is not necessary. Whatever that feeling is in me that I need to be surrounded is going to shed it and I'm going to shed it with easier things, right? With clothes I don't like, bags, crap like this. So yeah, well, thank you. Um, I will give you a, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll come talk while I'm putting it back so you can help me through the bag situation. But yeah, so I will be back once it's fixed. And then my carpet cleaning is happening. And uh, yeah, I'd like to talk to you guys with that too. I just don't want to put everything back. Okay. So maybe we can go through like bag by, I, I just put everything in bags or tubs. So yeah, now's the time. Now's the time. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. I hope you have some comments. Let me know what you do. Do you have a bag and box tin problem? Or are you like, what? See you soon. So here is the end result. Luckily, my dishwasher, he fixed it. This needed to be hanging up differently, I think. So, um, yeah, but I got put some, got rid of a lot of stuff. Let me give some cleaners to the food bank. And a bunch of towels went in a bag to the garage. Um, you know, they're good to have 
if you need them, but I don't need them here. And I ordered a thing for here to make them easier to get in and out, you know, so there's like that kind of thing. Actually, you know what? I think I got that from Amazon. So let me put that in. Hold on. So this is the, it's just called a kitchen rack, right? So I'm going to load this up. <clears throat> so I had stuck that back there weirdly. So I'm not sure that's going to work. <clears throat> All right. Give me a second.